Hello, I'm Kim Sales, and this is a book review of 30 Days to Unstoppable, The Dream Made Visible by Whitney Freya. Before we get into the book, I just wanted to show you the beautiful cover. It has a fabulous picture of uh, illustrating Metatron's cube and the vast spaciousness that's open to you. So let's open this book by Whitney Freya and dig in. On the first few pages here, we're going to see some lovely praise for 30 Days to Unstoppable. As you can see, this book has inspired many, and a lot of them have actually taken the time to put in a lovely praise and review for the book itself. Um, I know you'll love it as much as I do, and that's why I'm doing a review on it. I wanted to start with some of the author's words why this book is for you. It's for who believe in magic who have always known life is extraordinary, who are devoted to embodying your most, uh, most authentic self, who envision a world that honors interconnectedness while celebrating diversity, who are learning to be more and more proud of your idealistic nature, who are dreamers, who are, in effect, holding space for what's possible for a humanity that chooses love, who want to step into, into life each day bathed in a sense of union, with the earth below your feet and the stars above your head, who are ready for change. And so it is. Like that's such a beautiful way to start the book. Flipping the page, we are going to see the table of contents. And as you can see, Whitney's laid it out from day one all the way down to day 30. So she welcomes you to follow it each day or, you know, take your time and just do what feels right to you. What I love is that she has a lot of spaciousness on each page and she here goes through her channeled message for you and um, the contents of the book. She has a lovely introduction here and you can see there's lots of white space so you can take notes. She wants you to interact and really be a part of this. We go through and she explains the language of sacred geometry and what that means and how it affects you each day and um, then tells you a bit about her backstory and where she's from and um, what she's accomplished. Getting started, this is a part that I think I'd like to read to you. My vision for this book is to serve you in the remembrance that you are a vibrational being who knows how to nourish and care for yourself and awaken within you a process of perceiving and creating that will liberate you from the limitations of the material world. You may read one chapter per day for 30 days or you may just read when you have time allowing the ideas to sink in and become a part of your daily reality. Either way, use this book as a guiding light as you watch your world transform. This book is designed to be experienced within your internal landscape as a guided meditation. These words, stories, and illustrations will activate you. The experience of this book will remind you that you are a vibrational being and that any feelings of being stuck, blocked, or small are ready to be transmuted into your own personal power. I encourage you to allow each day, each chapter to sink in. Allow the ideas shared in each chapter to dance around you and inspire your musings. If the ideas challenge your rational mind, let that be okay. Let them speak to your heart. Days 1 through 3 will introduce you to a foundational elements to support your shift into unstoppableness. On day 4, I introduced a meditation inspired by the sacred geometry Metatron's Cube. It will become your Noah's Ark, the inner vehicle from which you experience an entirely new frequency of support, flow, safety, and security in this rocky world. On days five and six, you get to know both the Flower of Life and Metatron's Cube more intimately. On day seven, you begin the process of embodying yourself as the unstoppable dream, and the journey continues through day 30. The illustrations at the beginning of each chapter are my visual interpretation of the channeled messages. In italics on the opposite page, I found this process to be extremely enlightening and fun. I invite you to do the same in your own journal. If that resonates with you, how could you illustrate that text? I can't wait to see it. And so it is. And what I wanted to do as I'm flipping through as you're watching this, you'll see Metatron's cue. But behind the book, you'll see my actual artist journal where I've painted Metatron's cube, some other vibrational things that I found came through when I did the meditations. Um, this book opened up so much for me that it gave me the wings to really start on my own path and start 
living my most inspired life, right? Um, I can't say enough about it. It's a book you have to pick up and experience. It um, changed how I view things. And as you can see here, the unstoppable dream process, you'll see the Metatron's cube and her spheres of wellness. There's love, compassion, courage, alignment, gratitude, and presence that complete the spheres of wellness for Metatron's cube. So please pick up the book. Uh, it's loaded with all sorts of lovely exercises and areas for you to be able to write. There's also, as you can see where I'm pointing out here, YouTube um, links in the book that you can go to and follow and she'll help you create uh, Metatron's Cube and walk you through that process. Uh, Whitney has also gone ahead since this book was completed and published and put on her YouTube channel, Whitney Freya's YouTube channel, um, chapters of each book where the, she actually goes in and reads the book to you and walks you through some of the magic while creating an art journal. Um, I hope this has been helpful. I hope you enjoy this book as much as I do. I consider it my personal go-to whenever I need to um, really take hold of what's important and remember. Remember union. Remember you're a co-creator of your own life. And I just absolutely recommend this book. So please go ahead, pick one up, um, and enjoy it. Thank you so much for listening. Um, Mwah. Keep creating, creating the life you want and what you want more of. Um, this book will help you get there. Take care. I'm Kim Sales, a creatively fit coach and artist.